Hey guys, it's Gaming Center here, and welcome to basically the first art time lapse video of 2018. So let's start off with a art trade with Nikki Vendetta on DeviantArt of her character Orion. I'm just gonna say this right now, I am extremely happy with how the main body of this character came out. It just looks like I gave the body much more depth compared to my other male images. And just think, it was all because I just gave him an armpit. If there's one thing I'm still a bit iffy on is with just how sort of fluid I would say the tail is because it's almost like a uh, Naga's tail in my veins with how I did it. Well, I still think it at least came out, but and basically you're just gonna see the coloring process of it in order to see why. This is something I've been doing with sort of the eyes. I don't draw them uh, traditionally. I just save them for basically when I do it digitally, if I do want to do it digitally. And the style that I'm doing with the eyes currently, right now, is actually something that I did with all of my Christmas pictures. It's honestly pretty easy and simple, and uh, honestly, I feel like I'm going to use this uh, more so throughout um, probably the rest of the art part art career unless I figure out like a different kind of eyes that I want to use and to think uh, years ago I actually didn't want to do these kind of eyes <laughs> to 
This is probably what made the picture so much better in my opinion compared to what was originally planned at least for it and, and that was basically just common saving. I wanted to highlight the body that I did so much that I decided to just put in the extra effort for basically saying this part. What ended up happening is basically I got so into the shading that I ended up doing the entire thing shaded. I, again, I didn't expect doing this because I don't really do that much shading wise, but I guess I just felt so proud of this one that I went the extra mile. This is why I said I'm happy about how the tail came out in the end because of the shading and the sign that I added to it. The sign effect is sort of something that I got from a friend with one of her drawings. I'll get into it in probably a different video, but I'll just say that yeah, it definitely made the tail part much better than I thought it was originally. Probably the most difficult part of this picture for me was sort of doing the by scratch background and that was, I was always planning on doing the background and, but it ended up turning to again much bigger than I thought. It just started with like just adding in some like in clouds and like a sun but then later on I basically sort of added in a, a little island because I felt there needed to be something there and then I added a little tree, a little happy tree because I, I just wanted to add that in so that it didn't look so bland out there even though it does stick out like a sore thumb. The other thing that I was sort of having a bit of difficulty with was the rock. I did have a second screen, luckily. I have a, a sort of a hand-me-down monitor. I utilized that sort of like as a secondary source that I can glance back at so that I can sort of recolor the rock. It, it, I still hopefully got got it, but I don't know, it still feels, I guess, a bit off to me. The difficult part, which you'll see later, are the waves. That, that shit. <laughs> um, uh, because, um, because paint on that isn't as complex as something like, um, as complex 
as a uh, Photoshop, I wasn't really, I'm not easily able to get sort of like the best kind of sort of waves, but I feel like I managed at least a good bit of it, if you know what I mean. Uh, just like a bit of like crashing against the waves, having this sort of semi-transparency to make it look like sort of the white parts that are like at the top of waves, and I feel like I at least did a decent job at best. Um, I, I still think I could have at least done better with like more under my belt, but I'm still happy with how this came out again. And that's about it. Another little picture that I put a lot more work into it than I thought, and for an art trade picture. <laughs> well, I'm definitely happy with how this came out, but I still know that I have a long ways to go to improve my art. So again, thank you guys so much for coming out. GG, and see you later.